with the whole world laughing at us, but we're not dead. In fact, I feel more alive now than I ever felt. In the movie Grudge Match, Henry Razor Sharp and Billy the Kid McDonough are a couple of boxers linked together in history. 30 years ago, these two were at the top of their game, and their only career losses came at the hand, or glove of the other, one loss apiece. There once was a scheduled third bout that was destined to vault these two sluggers into sports world immortality, only it never took place. It all fell apart back when Kid and Razor's girlfriend Sally had an affair. It was a gut shot that hit Razor so hard he unlaced his gloves, quit the fight biz, and never looked back. The only thing he took with him from this rocky relationship was a raging bull of a hatred for his former opponent. 30 years later, and those feelings haven't changed. Some things have changed though, mainly in the financial arena. And when a video game matchup leads to talk of a real world bout, the idea of $100,000 purses start to sound sweet. Time to tone up some of the 60-year-old flab. This tale of over-the-hill palookas is, at its heart, a movie about letting go of bitterness and moving past old regrets to find a better future. I'm a fighter. I was born to be a fighter. You got every right to hate him, but I need you in my corner. The cinematic road to those lessons of renewal, however, meanders through all kinds of questionable content that includes the one-two punch of coarse and inappropriate sensuality and lots and lots and lots of foul language. So I'll only be able to give Grudge Match just two knockout punches out of five for family friendliness. For an in-depth review of this film or anything else at the box office, visit us at PluggedIn.com. Plugging you into the movies, I'm Bob Walaszewski for Focus on the Family's Plugged In Movie Review.